The hardest thing is when you wake up in the morning knowing it's going to happen all over again. You lie there as long as you want. You focus on this point in your room or in your house or anywhere, anywhere you may be. And you wish you could not get up. You wish you could just lie there. But, but, at the end, you get up and you feel like your head, the words are not real, but they are real. And you feel like you have been left behind and you feel like you can't move. You feel like no one understands you. No one knows what you are going through. No one sees what you do because it's always inside your head. But because you are not the only one that sees, people tell you that it's not real. But you know it is. Okay, and you decide to keep it to yourself. Fine, you decide to keep it to yourself. And you don't want anyone to worry you. But, but even behind closed doors, in your quiet times, even your dark place, they still come back. The problems you left behind, they still come back. You, you, your friends, your, your your parents, your family, your close ones, they can understand. They, they, they live a different life. They have a different vision from what you have. So, so you feel you can't understand. In fact, they can't understand. So, you just want to be left alone. You can't breathe. No one around you. You feel isolated. You feel lonely. For you, there seems to be no way out. And you feel you are the only one going through this. But I want you to know that you are not the only one. The one out of five teenagers, the one out of five youths out there, they go through this. They go through depression.